Well, welcome back, LJ TV. Sorry I've been absent. I've been like way under the weather. Because when I get sick, I get like deathly sick. Where I end up in the hospital and it's always bad. I know my nose is kind of stuffy. I sound really nasally. But that's not going to stop me. What I want to show you guys, even though I do product reviews and some tutorials and I make my own stuff, I also am into heavily into computers and technology. And there's one I came across. I just got this MacBook. This is the 2012 version, and I updated it to to High Sierra. I never owned a MacBook. I've always been a PC guy. But I just wanted to try the other end of the spectrum. And there was a security exploit that if you type in a certain word, you can gain full access to the entire computer. Now, people, most people will boast on how secure Mac OS, it, OS the Mac operating system is, but my years of working with computers as every PC, every computer has a flaw. Macintosh is not the, the most extraordinary operating system there is, not the most secure there is. We all know Windows has its flaws, but some of you that use Linux, you know how good that one is. But it has its flaws, and, and Mac is no different. It's still a personal computer. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna show you how to get into to your uh, anybody's MacBook. Really, hopefully you don't do that, but this should be a concern. I think there's an update for it that rectifies this problem. So, on how you do it, you go down your system preferences. And then you go to your uh, users and groups. Then there's a little lock down to the bottom left hand corner. It says click the lock to make changes. So when you click the lock, you greet it with a little message right here. If you're trying to unlock it, you have to have your username and password. But what you do, you take out the username and leave the password blank. You type in root and you press enter. Bam, just like that, you're in. It could be anybody's MacBook that has High Sierra or even lower. You just type in root, leave the password blank, hit enter, and you're in there. Nothing to it. Now you can do whatever you want to the whole entire system. <laughs> so just uh, share the word on this right here. Whoever owns a MacBook, make sure they know about this and update the system so you know so this won't happen to them so if you like the content and you, you enjoy this kind of stuff just give me, leave me a thumbs up subscribe if you haven't and i'll see you in the next video